prayer before the rosary. We know the Holy Rosary. You have deigned to come to Fatima to reveal the three shepherd children, the treasures of grace hidden in the rosary. Inspired by my heart with sincere love of this devotion, in order that by meditating on the mysteries of our redemption, which are recalled in it, I may be rich with its fruits and obtain peace for the world, the conversion of sinners, and the favor which I ask for in this rosary. For Emily and Esther Sarda, I ask it for the greater glory of God, for your honor, and for the good of souls, especially for my own. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father, Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day He rose again from the dead. He ascended to heaven and seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there she shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. For the virtues of faith, hope, and love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. Glory be the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, yes, now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O oh, Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden. I desire true repentance for my sins. Think of our Lord Jesus in the Garden of Gethsemane, suffering a bitter agony for our sins. The suffer, the suffer, whom the Master had been said for, Amel and Esther Sarda. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, yes, now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need of thy mercy. O oh Mary, how me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. The second sorrowful mystery, scourging at the pillar. I desire a spirit of mortification. Think of the cruel scourging at the pillar that our Lord suffered. The heavy blows that tore his flesh. Let's pray for those that might be suffering from various types of physical illnesses, mental or spiritual. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins. 
Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need of thy mercy. O Mary, how you see God's love for me today. And St. Wilfred, pray right. for us. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning with thorns. I desire moral courage. Think of the crown of sharp thorns that was forced upon our Lord's sacred head and the patience with which he endured the pain for our sins. Let's say this for all of those that are in charge of our government and our churches and all through our the United States in this world to have the moral courage to do the things that are right and to do the things that are are through our Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O oh, Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilfred, pray for us. The poor self, the mystery, the dying of the cross. I desire the virtues of patience. Think of the heavy cross so willingly carried by our Lord and ask him to help you carry your crosses without complaint. Let us offer this decade for the good health and safety of all our family members. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most need thy mercy. O Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilfred, pray for us. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion. Think, I desire the grace of final preservation. Think of the love which filled Christ's sacred heart during his three hours agony on the cross and ask him to be with you at the hour of death. Let's offer this up for the sick in all our nursing homes and the sick in all our parishes and anyone else who needs our prayers, and especially the people on our prayer chain. And a, a little boy who was two years old died and his funeral was today. And yes, I'm a cousin and that it was his grandma. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, Give us this day, day our daily bread, bread and, and forgive us our trespasses, trespasses as, as we forgive, forgive those who trespass, trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, God pray, pray for us sinners, sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. O oh, Mary, help me to see God's love for me today. And St. Wilford, pray for us. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, our life, our sweetness, our hope. To thee we cry for banished children of Eve. To thee we sin of our sighs, mourning and weeping this valley of tears. Turn in that most gracious advocate, the eyes of mercy toward us. And after this, our exile shown to us to bless the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, the Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. The prayer after the rosary. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee that meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. May the divine assistance remain with us. Amen. And may the souls of the faithful departed through the mercy of God rest in peace. Amen. Amen. The memorari. Remember, O oh, most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession, was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto you, O oh, Virgin of Virgins, my Mother. To you I come, before you I stand, sinful and sorrowful. O oh, Mother of the Word incarnate, Despise not my petitions, but in your mercy hear and answer me. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Well, good afternoon, everybody. Uh, today's uh, Mass is uh, being celebrated for the repose of the soul of Emil and Esther Carta. So do remember uh, them both. Um, Sarta. Oh, it's Sarta. 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 Carta. I've always pronounced it Carta. You've been probably put up with that all your life then. Yeah. Huh? yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know who you're talking to. Just, just don't call me late for dinner, right? That's that's the big one. Yeah. So uh, Sarta then. Uh, Emil. Uh, Emil. Emil. And it's... Uh, 
your dad, okay, and mom, your mom and dad, okay. Matter of fact, we just uh, read Esther, uh, the uh, story of Esther uh, last, yesterday, as a matter of fact. So, Emil, then, Emil. Very good. So, let us begin, if you will, take your uh, word among us or your living with Christ and begin with uh, saying the entrance antiphon Set me free from my distress, O Lord. See me loneliness and suffering. Take away all my sins. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words and what I have done and what I have failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask the Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and to you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. Grant that your faithful, O Lord, we pray, may not uh, may be so conformed to the paschal observances that the bodily disciplines now solemnly begun may bear fruit in uh, the souls of all. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of the prophet Ezekiel, thus says the Lord God, the wicked man turns away from all sins he uh, committed. If he keeps all my statutes and does what is right and just, he shall uh, surely live and shall not die. None of the crimes he committed shall be remembered against him. He shall live because of the virtue he has practiced. Do I indeed derive any pleasure from the death of the wicked, says the Lord God? Do I not rather rejoice when he turns from his evil way that he may live? And if the virtuous man turns from the path of virtue to do evil, same kind of uh, abominable things that the wicked man has done, can he do this and still live? None of his virtuous deeds shall be remembered because he has broken faith and committed sin. Because of this, he shall die. You say, the Lord's way is not fair. Here now, house of Israel, is it my way that is unfair, or rather, are not your ways unfair? When someone uh, virtuous turns away from virtue and commits iniquity and dies, it's because of the iniquity he committed that he must die. But if the wicked turning from the wickedness that he has committed does what is right and just, he shall preserve his life since he has turned away from all sins that he committed. And he, and he shall uh, surely live and shall not die. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Okay, good. That's, that's the right one. Okay, good. I was about to say, I had a different one in the ice cream. <laughs> If you, O Lord, uh, mark our iniquities, who shall stand? If, if you, O Lord, mark our iniquities, who shall stand? stand? Out of the depths I cried, you, O Lord, Lord, hear my voice. Let your ears be attentive to the voice of my, you know, to my voice in supplication. If you, O Lord, mark iniquities, who can stand? If you, O Lord, mark iniquities, Lord, who can uh, stand? But with you is forgiveness that you may be revered. If you, O Lord, mark in equities, who can stand? I trust in the Lord, my soul trusts in his word. My soul waits for the Lord more than sentinels wait for the dawn. Israel, wait for the Lord. If you, O Lord, mark in equities, who can stand? For with the Lord is kindness, and with him is a plenteous redemption, and he will redeem Israel from all their iniquities. 
If you, O oh Lord, mark in iniquities, who can stand? Praise and glory to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Praise and glory to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Cast away from you all the, the crimes you have committed, says the Lord, and make for yourself a new heart and a new spirit. Praise and glory to you, Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, I tell you, unless your righteousness surpasses that of the scribes and Pharisees, you will not enter into the kingdom of heaven. You have heard that it was said in, uh, to your ancestors, you shall not kill, and whoever kills will be uh, liable to judgment. But I say to you, whoever is angry with his brother will be liable to judgment. And whoever says uh, to his brother, Rahwa, will, uh, will be answerable to the Sanhedrin. And whoever says, you fool, will be liable to fiery Gehenna. Therefore, if you bring your gift to the altar and there recall that your brother has anything against you, leave your gift there at the altar. Go first and be reconciled with your brother, and then come and offer your gift. Settle with your opponent quickly while on the way to court. Otherwise, your opponent will hand you over to the judge. The judge will hand you over to the guard, and you will be thrown into prison. Amen, I say to you, you will not be released until you have paid the last penny. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to the Lord Jesus Christ. Please, 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 please go to your Bible and mark Matthew chapter 5. Because this is where you'll always hear our, our, our fundamentalists and Protestant brothers and sisters. Where do you find purgatory in the Bible? And, of course, purgatory, you just read, you just heard about purgatory. Because listen to what uh, Jesus reminds us today. He says, unless you, uh, uh, let's see, uh, amen, I say to you, you will not be released until you have paid the last penny. Of course, this is referring to uh, debtor's prison. And the way that debtor's prison worked, of course, and this is the problem we have when we separate ourselves from 2,000 years, is, a person was in debt and could not pay off the debt, he'd be thrown into jail and, and then would require what his friends and his neighbors and his relatives to come and pay the, the debt. And of course, this is what Jesus uh, uses to have us understand how it works uh, in the kingdom of God as well. Those individuals who died and then, of course, uh, go before God and, and in his grandeur and then says to him, you know, God, I don't deserve hell, but boy... I'm not quite ready for heaven. And God says, don't worry. Don't worry. There's, there's a place for you to prepare. Because why? There are no party poopers allowed in heaven. It can't be done your way, but rather it has to be done God's way. And this is what Ezekiel is reminding us in the first reading today. It's we are conforming our will to God. So there is this place of purgation. This place, it's a mysterious place, yes, but, but still a place of purgation. And that what we can do here on earth as as we love our, uh, our uh, brothers and sisters in church suffering, we just prayed, as a matter of fact, yesterday's Mass for the four souls of purgatory, that we can help them with our prayers. We can so be that, that means a bail for them. And yes, by our sacrifices and what we're going to do today, for instance, with saying the stations of the cross, we can gain indulgences. We can offer the, the sacrifices we make here on earth in faith. And that's the key word. In faith that knowing God's never going to be outdone in love. And that that love, those that are in purgatory will be able to be able to pay that, that last penny. And of course, remember there is an economy to salvation. There is truly an economy to our salvation when it's our turn. And we find ourselves before God. And we have to say to God as well, you know, God, I don't think I deserve hell. But at the same time, I think I'm going to be one of the party poopers. I need some time. I need some time. And God will say, okay. But we do know that when we pray for the poor souls of purgatory here on earth, when they are in heaven, they'll be praying for us. They'll be there to help us along the way as well. Remembering that we can be able, as we hear in today's first reading, to, to be able to know that the just are always going to be heard by God, much loved by God. 
So with that now in mind, let us join together our prayers, going to our Heavenly Father in faith with our prayers, our supplications, and most especially our thanksgivings. So Heavenly Father, we begin that way, to, to remind ourselves that we don't just see you as Santa Claus where we sit on your lap and tell you what we want and expect that uh, uh, at some future time will be granted to us. No, we do realize that you are a Father. So we want to give thanksgiving to you for all the gifts that you have bestowed upon us and to ask you to help us to look back and to, to appreciate these gifts in our daily lives. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And to that Heavenly Father, as we do recognize that we are a pilgrim church and and join church triumphant, we pray for the poor souls, the church suffering. Heavenly Father, may, may our prayers and sacrifices that we are going to uh, um, be practicing this now Lent uh, be like my grandmother says, offering up for the poor souls. Heavenly Father, may, may our Lent uh, be something of a reward not only to ourselves, but also to our neighbors, neighbors we do not even know. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, realizing that you're never outdone in love, we, we turn to you and ask you to help us and to bless us as we do make this Lenten uh, journey. Heavenly Father, may it be fruitful according to, to your will that we can come on the other side of this 40 days, this quarantine, and be enriched by uh, what you show us. We pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayer. Now, Heavenly Father, in charity, we also want to remember to give preferential treatment and prayer to the poor. We do pray for those who do not have adequate housing, clothing, and food, and, and ask you, Heavenly Father, with so many that uh, that uh, are, are often uh, shy or, or you know, have the right side, uh, type of pride, don't want other people to know uh, their, their situation. Help us to recognize those that are in true need and from the blessings that have been freely given to us that we can share freely with those that are in want. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Now we pray for all those who have gone before us. Uh, mark with a sign of faith as we remember Neil and, and Esther in particular today. But for all of our holy dead, may they share the promise of eternal life with you in heaven. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Finally, Heavenly Father, we also want to pray for all those who are our leaders, those you have put into our lives uh, to, to guide us. We pray for our civic leaders as well as church leaders. Send your Holy Spirit to be with them as they do serve as servants to the servants, that they will serve the common good according to your will and serve it well. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And now we also pray for our children, that they too, the next generation, will be inspired by the faith that has been given to us and that they will uh, share that faith with uh, those around them as well to, to bring about a conversion in the, so into the 21st century. We pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. prayer. Now we present you those petitions that we hold dearest to our own hearts. For all of these, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Heavenly Father, as we don't know the poor souls in the same way that we don't even know who it might be uh, uh, along with us here uh, at this Mass on live stream, now in faith we join all of our prayers together as, as the church and present these petitions to you asking, make perfect what is imperfect in them, having faith that, that what your will is is what is uh, good for us. Now we present them to you through our mediator, Jesus Christ, our eldest brother, we know lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit as God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you. Fruit of the earth and work of human hands will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever.
Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands, become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and good of all of his holy church. Accept the sacrificial offerings, O Lord, by which in your power and kindness you willed us to be reconciled to yourself and our salvation to be restored through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your Lift up your hearts. We lift up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is, right and just. it is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for you have given your children a sacred time for the renewing and purifying of their hearts that freed from disordered affections, they may so deal with the things of this passing world as to hold rather to the things that eternally endure. And so with angels and, and saints, we praise you as without end we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the font of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your spirit upon them like the dewfall, so they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more, giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is a chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks you have thought us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly, we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, and Donald, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who please you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs through eternal life, and we praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command, informed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. 
and lead us not into temptation, and deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be, all, be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will. Live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Lamb of God, you, you take, take away the, the sins of the world. Of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. And again, if you take your living with Christ or your word among us, let us say together the communion antiphon. As I live, says the Lord, I do not desire the death of the sinner, but rather that he turn back and live. And again, in your uh, charity today, do remember me and mom and dad, uh, uh, Sartas here from when we offer this mass in your charity. Let us pray. May the holy refreshment of your sacrament uh, restore us new, anew, O Lord, in cleansing us from old ways. Take us up into the mystery of salvation through Christ our Lord. Amen. And again, after Mass, I'll be available for confessions. And then, of course, Stations of the Cross is going to be at 7 p.m. And then uh, anybody, again, would like to stay for confession after Stations Cross, I'll be available. And also remember, tomorrow, 8.30 uh, is uh, Mass uh, uh, for Saturday. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. 
Bow your head and pray for God's blessing. Look with favor on your people, O Lord, that what they, uh, what their observance outwardly de declares, it may inwardly bring about through Christ our Lord. Amen. May the blessing of Almighty God descend upon you and remain with you forever. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God.